Hey there, it's Patrick again. Now here's a drill I developed to help you swing your arms when you walk, and I call it the Swamp March, or the Swamp Walk. If you like this video, be sure to give me a thumbs up, and if you just found me, make sure you click the red subscribe button below and ring the bell icon so you'll never miss a new video. All my DVD programs are either available on Amazon or my website, but I've launched a new on-demand platform that contains every program I have ever produced, plus a growing library of exclusive content. You can ch check that out. It's got a seven day free trial that's available on my website. Now, I did this Swamp March with an online class that I've been running during COVID-19 that's free. And if you wanna join us for that, just email me at patrick at smartxpd.com and I'll add you to the list and you'll get a link and a password, no charge. And this is part of the class. I hope you like it, the Swamp Walk. Okay, so go ahead and um, march in place here. We're gonna do the swamp walk. I talk a lot about reciprocal, the body's reciprocal pattern that it performs when we walk. Um, real important to break down, understand, and practice. So the swamp walk is a little drill I came up with. We've done this before, uh, but it's gonna help you coordinate that reciprocal pattern, upper body, lower body. And the visualization for this is if you were marching through a swamp or a bog, some sort of sticky stuff that was about knee high in order to walk, you would pick your foot up and step forward out of that swamp. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna bring our hands here in front of our shoulders and we're gonna pick our right leg up and press the left or reciprocal leg up overhead. Back and forth. Now, if this is balance challenging, start small, small. Just a little bit of a lift. But as you get more comfortable with it, um, you're gonna pick up the knee a little bit higher. Now there's a little nuance to this that I want you to notice. When you perform that knee lift and that shoulder press, the body is never still over that stance leg. It's weight shifting out and back. I'll exaggerate it here for you. So you see I'm not stopping and trying to do this. I am basically doing the weight shift back and forth that we would do when we walk. You know, you are single leg balancing, but it's single leg balance and flow. So there's kind of a threshold that you kind of go through and kind of carry yourself until that foot lands and regains your balance for the other side. Back and forth, stretch up. And if you're ready to make it even bigger, the swamp walk is something you could do if you have problem with the drill we do when we're running in place. You pick it up and stretch. If you've got this down, you wanna add some to it as you pick that leg up Flex the ankle, lift the toes up towards the knee. Back and forth, swamp walk, up and down. Okay, good, now we're just gonna march in place. Holding on to the hand weights, just letting the arms swing. I, as I march, I'm not moving my elbow. I'm maintaining a 90 degree bend in this arm here. So the mass of the arm really just swings from the shoulder. It um, kind of simplifies the, the movement. And I'm not crossing my body either. I'm swinging the hands straight forward. So we're marching in place, pick it up, and we're gonna go right into the swamp walk. Bring your hands up, right leg, left hand, up, stretch, and bring it down, up, stretch, up. Good. Up, really reach. And notice the flow. Notice the way you're kind of swinging from side to side. Notice how it feels when you place that foot down on the floor and shift your weight to it. How you kind of gain control from one side to the other. We'll do two more after this one. Here we go, one. Stretch it up, big movements. And two. And back to marching in place. See if you can find that cadence, that reciprocal movement. Glance down towards the floor. I talk about kind of 
observing the movement of the reciprocal limbs and see if you kind of see that see that video of the, that that image of your legs moving opposite arm opposite leg very good breathe good and we'll do one more time this is our interval part of the class we're not going to get into the running today we're just going to use this as our intense part all right bring the hands up again co-coordinating upper body and lower body raise that right leg press the left hand up and other side stretch and reach and as you glance forward notice the reciprocal pattern notice the right hand left leg the left hand right leg good Janice really good you guys all right inspiration Greg good job good let's do four more presses one two three four and let's cap it with a little bit of marching in place here to reinforce the learning that we just did and reinforce the pattern very good and go ahead and put the hand weights aside remain standing so i hope you like this video if you do please feel free to share it with your friends and don't forget to give me a thumbs up if you liked it and click the red subscribe button below so you'll never miss a new video keep moving my friends i'll see you at the gym